Welcome back, everyone. Glendale just can't get enough, can they? They want more action in just four days. The city will shine as Swifties hit State Farm Stadium to kick off Taylor Swift's Eras Tour. Yeah, they, they just had the Super Bowl, and now this. <laughs> Team 12's Jen Wall joins us from Glendale, where the city is making a big change to honor the pop star. Jen? Yeah, we are standing outside of State Farm Stadium where Taylor Swift is going to be making everyone feel like they're 22 on March 17th and 18th, Friday and Saturday, just days away. And the city of Glendale announcing today their new name, Swift City, just in time for Taylor Swift's concert as she descends here in just a few days. Now, this is the first time State Farm Stadium will host sold out back to back shows. The city of Glendale holding a bejeweled press conference Today, March 13th, significant for Swifties. Who know? That's the artist's lucky number. Glendale also taking today to announce the city's temporary name change, and they also announced 13 other runners up like Swiftdale, Maroondale, and Taylordale. Glendale even renaming Mayor Jerry Wires Mayor Swifty. And for concert goers heading out to the show this weekend, there are all kinds of Taylor themed drinks and food at Westgate restaurants to help Swifties dance in their best dress fearless. We talked with Mayor Swifty this morning about what it takes to temporarily change a city's name. This is a ceremonial change. We're not, we're not going out and, uh, and changing our street signs. I had some people call me and go, what are you guys doing? Well, we're trying to enjoy the event. Uh, it's a ceremonial name change. Uh, and, and I hope people have enough humor uh, that they could they could understand uh, the importance of why we want to do this. And we also want to share some tips with you if you're going to be in the area or if you're going to the show Friday or Saturday. Glendale recommends buying parking ahead of time. Don't rely on GPS to get here because it might not update fast enough. There's also ride share in the black lot. And remember the clear bag policy plus the cashless stadium. And finally, Tickets were outrageously expensive when they first went on sale. Remember that? Well, I just checked, and it looks like they're as low as about $170. So if you're thinking about heading out to Swift City this weekend, you might even have a chance to shimmer and be jeweled with Taylor Swift herself. For now, we're in Glendale. Jen Wall, 12 News.